Welcome back to Film On. Today I'm going to explain the movie called I Love You, Beth Cooper from 2009. Spoilers ahead. Watch out and take care. And I hope you enjoy it. The movie begins with the celebration day of Buffalo Glen High School. All of the students had to get on the stage and give a speech. Now it was Dennis's turn to give a speech. Dennis is such an intelligent student. He already received the award of the valedictorian card title. Since he was on the stage, he had to give a speech. He started his speech, but it was more of a love letter rather than a speech. In this speech, he talked about the love he has for the beautiful Beth Cooper. He said, when I was in class seven, I saw Beth for the very first time. I've lost myself in you. Every time I sat behind your desk, I fell in love with you. I've loved you for so long, but I've never confessed it because we never actually talked to each other. But now I'm not scared of anyone. I love you, Beth Cooper. Along with that, Dennis also confessed that he has an eating disorder. He also said that he's such a moron. He also said bad things about Greg and Beth's boyfriend, who's in the army. He requested his friend that finally he must admit that he's gay. Rich was so embarrassed after hearing this. Dennis kept talking like this, but then a teacher came up and stopped him. After that, the teacher asked Dennis if this was the right time for him to confess his love for Beth. Dennis said, you must have fallen in love sometime, right? The teacher recalled the days when she was in love with someone and left. Beth came to Dennis and said, you've really embarrassed me today. After that, she took off her gown and showed her hotness. Rich also came there. Dennis invites Beth over to his house for a party, but then Beth's boyfriend, Kevin, came there and started to bully Dennis. Luckily, the teacher came there and stopped him. When Dennis and Rich were talking to each other, we found out that Dennis never had a girlfriend in his life, and Rich was gay. Dennis was such a gentleman, and he followed all the rules, but the girls don't like a guy who's disciplined. Dennis went back to his house, and his parents were going out. His dad knew about the party. He told him that we're going out, but if you need any condoms, then take it from my room. Dennis's dad thought that tonight his son was about to lose his virginity. But Dennis and Rich were not sure about it. Beth went to Dennis's party with Treese and Cammie. Dennis was so nervous. At first, Beth made fun of Dennis because he was such a scared guy. Beth's friends said that Dennis was really cute. Beth asked Dennis, if you've organized a party, then where are the others? Slowly, we found out that there was no party at Dennis's house, but Beth and her friends began to enjoy the place anyway. Rich and Dennis had brought condoms with them, but they used them as balloons. At first, Beth was so rude with Dennis, but then she became cool with him after seeing his cuteness. When Beth was on top of Dennis, he got an erection. Beth told it to her friends and made fun of him. Dennis tried to hide his penis as well. Meanwhile, Kevin came to Dennis's house with his friends. He'd come here to beat Dennis. Dennis closed all the doors and he was busy stacking all the furniture in front of the doors to make sure that Kevin doesn't enter his house. But he forgot to close one door. Kevin and his friends entered the house through this door. Beth told him to go, but he didn't listen. Kevin and his friends broke everything inside the kitchen. They even beat the shit out of Rich and Dennis. Beth and her friends went ahead to save Rich and Dennis, and they ran away from there in Beth's car. After that, they went to a gas station, and Beth went inside to buy some beer. But the cashier didn't accept Beth's driving license. The driving license said that Beth was 36 years old. No one would believe that she's 36. Beth tried to seduce him, but the guy said that this is my job and I cannot disrespect it. After that, Beth kissed him for a while and he gave her the beer. Dennis realized that Beth is not the girl he thought she would be. After that, they went to a quiet place and they set up a fire. Dennis told Beth that you should not use your body like this. You can't just kiss a random guy for beer. He also said that I respect you a lot. Beth realized the fact. Meanwhile, Rich and Beth's friend went to the cow shed but Rich stepped on a cow's poop, and suddenly the cows went after them. Dennis told Beth that I want to sing a song for you. The song has your name in it. Now Beth realized that Dennis loves her a lot, and she accepted his love for her. But then the cows came there, and they got in the car. All of them ran away from the cows in the car. We saw that Beth was such a reckless driver. She was driving like crazy, and she hit a car beside the road. And we saw that there was Dennis's mom and dad having sex in the car. Beth was about to crash into their car, but luckily they were safe. They didn't want to see Dennis's dad without his pants on, so they drove away from there. Beth took them to Valley's house. There was a party going on. 
We saw that Greg took Dennis to a quiet room and it looked like he was about to beat him. But then he put his head on Dennis's shoulder and started to cry. He said that you've helped me to understand the wrong. You're my best friend from now on. Dennis also hugged him. Meanwhile, Kevin went to the party with his friends and started to beat Dennis. Greg went ahead to save Dennis and he beat the shit out of Kevin and his friends. Suddenly, Beth entered the party with Kevin's car and ran away from there with Dennis and his friends. Beth took them to her school. She had the keys to her school since she was a cheerleader. Beth danced in front of Dennis with her friends, and Dennis was happy to see it. After that, they went to take a shower. Beth was almost naked in front of Dennis, and then she went to take a shower with her friends. But Kevin attacked Dennis. Rich tried to defend him and Dennis. His most powerful weapon was his towel. Rich and Kevin were fighting with each other, and in this towel fight, Rich was the superior one. Kevin couldn't cope with Rich's attack with the towel. After that, Beth went out of there with her car. Dennis was injured at the time. His nose was bleeding. Beth asked him to take off his shirt, so he did. Beth swung his shirt and was having fun with it, but suddenly she dropped the shirt, so Beth and Dennis went outside to look for it. But a wild cat appeared in front of them and was about to attack them. After that, they went to the family cabin of Trees. Beth and Dennis were sitting near the lake and waiting for the sunrise, whereas Trees and Cammy were with Rich. They asked him if he was really gay. Rich said that he doesn't know, he's not sure about it. After that, they had a threesome, and after they had sex, Rich was totally sure that he is gay. But Trees doesn't think so. On the other side, Beth and Dennis had their first kiss. Beth told him that she made a mistake by choosing a guy like Kevin. She also said that Kevin is such a loser, he's not worthy of becoming anyone's boyfriend. After that, they kissed once again and had sex. In the next scene, they came back to Dennis's house. Dennis's father realized that his son had lost his virginity. He was happy about it, but he was also mad that their house had become a garbage yard due to a fight between him and Kevin. He said that Dennis will have to pay for it for sure. Beth was about to leave, and she kissed Dennis in front of everyone. She had love for Dennis in her eyes. She told him, thank you for loving me this much. Dennis said, why shouldn't I? They promised each other that they would reunite in the high school reunion. And since then, if they don't have sex with anyone else, then they will marry each other. And just like that, the party ended and Beth left with her friends. Rich told Dennis that he actually is gay, but he's also interested in girls as well. Dennis told Rich, I can't wait any longer to meet Beth until the reunion. Rich told him to propose to Beth and they discussed with each other how he should propose to her. To watch more explanations of these kinds of movies, click on the videos on your screen. And don't forget to let me know how you feel about today's video in the comments down below. And at last I will say, stay safe, stay well, thanks.